morning. Thank you for being with us. More vaccine requirements are rolling out for workers as COVID cases continue to soar. State and county workers required to get the shots. Now we're learning some private businesses are also following suit and there could be more to come. Sam, Sam Spangler has more in a story that's new tonight at 9. Merriman's employees are now required to get their first dose of a vaccine by September the 10th. They can still apply for exemptions, whether that be sincere religious reasons or medical. Chef Peter Merriman tells me that he's also looking at requiring guests to show proof of vaccination. Merriman's has four locations in Hawaii, Hoipu, Honolulu, Kapalua, and in Waimea, where the recent surge of COVID-19 has hit hard. Owner Chef Peter Merriman says the decision was about the employees. And we felt like this is a way to create a super uh, safe workplace for them and for our guests as well. And I think um, the finally, the other part of it, we felt a civic responsibility. Chef Merriman says few employees vocally opposed it. Well, most of the employees have taken it really well because the majority of our employees are vaccinated. We're probably around 70% are vaccinated. Currently, 71.7% of the eligible population in the islands have been fully vaccinated. The Hawaii Restaurant Association says if workers are out for contact tracing or falling ill, they should stay home. But some don't even have paid sick leave. They have uh, extended the tax credit that employer uh, can, can get for uh, paying employees to stay home. The HRA conducted a survey this weekend to see if restaurants would be open to vaccinations required for employees and customers. From what I'm hearing, there are more restaurants in Hawaii that are already also doing it uh, or, or will be doing, uh, I think, because everybody recognizes that it's just everybody's problem. We're going to institute this eventually for the guest as well. And so we think that, and we're only doing that for, for health reasons, but it turns out, it just so happens that it also appears as if it might be a, a good business decision because some some customers are saying, hey, I'm going to need at your place more often. I'll come there several times a week because I'm going to feel safer at your place. Chef Merriman adds that he'll probably add outside seating for unvaccinated guests, similar to what you can see behind me. Now, he also tells me that those employees that decided to quit due to the vaccines will find a lucrative job market here in the islands. Sam Spangler, KH12 News, working for Hawaii.